So welcome here guys to my channel. Today I'm going to talk to you about deploying, especially how to deploy your first month smart contract on Beta 4. Uh, as you know, Fuel uh, recently released Beta 4, which is available for developers right now. And uh, we'll talk about deploying uh, your first smart contract. I believe it takes uh, 10, 15 minutes, no longer. Uh, so all you need is just my guide. Uh, it will be down below this video and all useful links be will be down below this video. So you need, uh, first of all, my guide. Also, you'll need a uh, fuel wallet and uh, faucet for test tokens. Okay, uh, without further ado, let's actually start. Uh, first of all, we'll need to complete a number of updates. Uh, if this is your first smart contract, just uh, copy the command from uh, my guide. Uh, then you'll need to enter your password, you're entering it, and it will make some updates. Um, after that, copy in another command. Uh, uh, in this command, you need to press Y, so you want to continue. Uh, and uh, uh, also, we need to install curl. Uh, also, pretty simple, just copy and comment and uh, pass in it in your um, terminal. Yeah. Uh, after that, we need to install a Rust tool chain. Also, pretty simple, just copy and comment, pass in it, and uh, we need to press one for uh, just default installation. Uh, then uh, just copy uh, command, uh, past it, and uh, if you already have the fuel uh, in pre-installed before, uh, you will need to delete old files. If this is the first time, it's actually not necessary, but actually anyway, I'll past it. Uh, just as an example, you know. Uh, after that, just we need to install Fuel Toolchain and uh, make sure it will take around five minutes, I believe. So just be sure to wait. Uh, of course, press Y to confirm. Yeah, and it will be downloading. Uh, after that, uh, we need to update uh, and set Beta 4 as a default. It's actually pretty simple, uh, just uh, write in this command. But before that, uh, we need to close and open uh, our terminal again uh, after installing Fuel Toolchain, of course. Yeah, and uh, uh, we need to copy and paste first column uh, to check uh, for updates. Uh, then we need to install uh, Beta 4 Toolchain uh and uh, after that we need to just set beta 4 as our default uh for now yeah and you'll receive uh such an output default tool chain set to beta 4. uh it uh, will mean that everything uh went actually right uh then just check the version and going to the next step, we need to create a directory. Uh, you can name uh, any way you want it. And just uh, we need to enter that uh, directory. Uh, okay, good. Uh, so uh, for now, we need to create a new smart contract by typing this command. And uh, uh, we need to edit uh, our uh, main.sw. Uh, file uh, by uh, pressing this command uh, and uh, below uh, this guide uh, we will uh, just copy uh, the uh, code and uh, replace it uh, yeah and just replace it so make sure to delete uh, the code uh, which is written already and uh, after that uh, just pass it yeah. Uh, quite simple and uh, some uh, steps control X uh, Y and enter so uh, yeah we want to modify enter and we've returned so uh, now we need to move to our counter contract folder uh, 
directory, <laughs> whatever you like. Uh, and uh, uh, now it's time to build your smart contract. Uh, type in fork build and just waiting, you know. Uh, so after that, um, you uh, need to set up or import your wallet. Uh, in my example, I'll uh, just uh, create a new one. If you already have it, you can just uh, follow the guide and uh, import your wallet uh, by typing your seed uh, phrases. Yeah, so uh, type in your wallet, uh, make sure to create a password, just like in MetaMask, for example, uh, you know, after that, uh, confirm your password, so uh, you make sure <laughs> you wrote it right, and you will receive your seed uh, phrases. Uh, this is just an example, so I'll show it to you, but uh, anyway, uh, always hide these uh, phrases and uh, make sure to write them down, of course. Um, so, uh, after that, uh, we need uh, to add it uh, to the list of wallets uh, and uh, one more time write our password and we'll see our fuel wallet address. Uh, you can also write it down, but um, anyway, uh, for now we need to faucet some tokens. Uh, and uh, this is actually quite simple uh, because uh, uh, we need to, to just copy our uh, wallet address yeah, and uh, pass it uh, into the file set uh, which you will find the link down below or in my guide, whatever you like actually. So just uh, pass in your wallet as I already shown. Uh, completing CAPTCHA, uh, okay, I'm not gonna pause that, <laughs> let's find crosswalks together, yeah, uh, and uh, give me ether, just write it, uh, you can check your transaction, but actually they are coming just immediately, so you just make sure everything went right, yeah. Uh, and uh, we are uh, almost uh, in the finish. You need to just try to port deploy testnet and it will build your first smart contract. Uh, of course, you'll be asked to write your password again. Of course, yeah, <laughs> forgot about that step. Uh, and uh, you need to just write your index of your account. I have just one account with index zero, just type zero. In my case, in your case, maybe you have more accounts, I don't know. Uh, and press Y. And actually that's it. You will receive your contract ID so you can find it in the Explorer. Uh, actually, pretty often it doesn't show, but Anyway, make sure if uh, you received your contract ID, 99.99% uh, that everything went right, everything works. Uh, just explore, uh, not showing all the transaction at the moment. It happens, we are still in testnet. And actually, uh, my guide uh, also has a front-end part. If you are interested, you can just uh, explore it uh, because Actually, uh, why not? You can just uh, play with that. Uh, make sure, uh, oh, just believe me, uh, it is not so complicated and uh, steps are just the same as I've done, but just copying, pasting commands. Uh, but uh, I believe that will be quite interesting. And uh, in the end, we'll, res uh, we'll create some uh, um, a counter program uh, with interacting with wallet, so it will be quite uh, quite awesome, I believe. So uh, that's all for now. Uh, if you encountered some problems, make sure to write them on uh, Fuel forum. I'll leave the link down below. So if you have some problems, just feel free to ask. The team is always ready to help. And uh, thanks for watching this video.